Okay, do it. Can you see me in that mirror? All right, it's going to be, um, we're going to go out and back with our left. So we're going to step out and go back out here. So it's out and back. Oh, good. <laughs> out, breathe. Nice. Just one more and then we'll switch. Other side. Good. Nice. Good. Now step out left. I can get enough in at that. So it's left and right push. Nice. Face is red. I'm glad. Me too. It's just because I'm going easy today because I don't want to be broken. Breathe. One more. Good. Here. And then open here. We're going to go right to the rotation. Right? So start. So it's squat. Punch. Squat. Punch. Nice. Good. Go one. I'm going to go as fast as you want. Yep. Meant to make you fall. Deadlift, down, it's up, it's down. Look ahead, look in the mirror, look at your shoulders. Breathe, come up. Next thing you gotta come down, you're gonna open your arms to the side, like this. Nice, right, one more. Next time you're gonna come out and open one. Good, up, up, both. Like so, ahead, out, back, gorge, breathe, Woo. gorge, ready? And then we're gonna go and do the half moon thing. We'll do it without the wall this time. So we're gonna come down with here, and you're gonna come up on your right leg, and you're gonna lift and open, extend, reach, and breathe and then come down and pretend that you're gonna do a pistol squat, but you're not. And then it's up, open, and then here, and you can play. Oh, okay. Wow, like I just did. Okay, that was good. Right here, back. Hold it upward. Woo. One more, come here, nice. One more, one more of the half moon. All right, so let's come down. Now it's the other side. Um, you, you were moving your right leg, now move your left leg. All right, and it, it's up, it's stack, it's open, right? And then you can pull and with the bottom arm and extend your leg and then round and open and in. It's hard. Woo. Yeah. Nice, pretty. It's hard to do. Yep. All right, good. I think we got a little butt kicked. I like it. Yeah, it's just too much. Nice lift, breathe. What time do you have to be out of here? I have to be there at 9.15. So 8.45? Yeah. We're getting close, I think. Do you like this guy? Yeah, he's good. Yeah. Him. I like his voice. I think he's a lunatic, though. Who is it? Jaden. I saw him on Australia's Got Talent. Oh. Jaden something. And then Tippy. 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 Nice. Reach. You're going to come down. You're going to flat back forward. You're going to take your right hand. To your right ankle. You can take your left hand in front of that and then you're going to rotate and look under your right arm, your left arm, whatever. Shift that weight. And then you're going to take your arms and walk all the way around to the other way. 
Oh, you see, and you can just breathe. Nice. Right, let your weight shift back a little forward. Shift it back a little forward. Feel that when you shift. Don't squeeze with the toes. Keep that weight equal. Nice. Now look up under. Push away with your opposite arm. Gorgeous. Yeah, nice. Yeah. Ooh, three. Nice. Want to do a headstand? Sounds good. Yeah. When was the last time you ever did a headstand? Really? Okay, you want to try a handstand? Yeah. Have you done handstands? Yeah. Okay. Not, probably not the right way. That's okay. I don't know that there's a right way. I mean, if you want to be a handstand acrobat and do all these crazy things, then there's a right way. But if you just want to be able to pop up and hold an inversion for a few seconds, it doesn't really matter. So right here, all right? This wall, if you come here just a little minute, right? and try to get yourself so that you can stay against this wall without falling backwards. You see what I mean? Those are the, that's the muscle you have to engage when you're in a handstand, right? Because if you're like this, you feel like you're gonna fall. So you're gonna be like this. The arm's going to be that engaged. There's this pelvic tuck that kind of happens, you know? So you're going to go up and kick up and pretend that that's going to happen. Um, the problem, though, is when most people go to go up, they collapse. That's the first thing. You can't collapse. So you're going to come. You're going to take your hands here, all right? And walk your feet out. Just Now get your arms as close and in line with your shoulders as you can. You're going to want to splay, and that's when you fall. They're closer than you think, and it's wicked uncomfortable until you master it. The next part of that is just walk onto your tippy toes and let the weight come onto your arms and feel what muscles you have to grab. All right, feel it? Mm -hmm. It's not as easy as it is. It's a lot. So then you can just walk in, let your head come, and just walk your tippies and walk your whole body and hold it. I know, it's very hard. So that's how you are gonna do a handstand. So you're just gonna let the back of your head come to the wall and you're just gonna push your butt forward, hold, and then come down. That's what your practice for your handstands are until that's comfortable for you. Then the next part of this, well you got and you don't have to do it now because that was weird for you. So then the next part of that is you're here and you're just gonna go like this. going to go and learn how to kick your feet up to your butt, right? It's hard, but that's nice, right? Let your head stay there. Now try to lift your thighs, get used to that way. Once you get used to that, then, so it's this, it's getting used to this, right? The head is here, you get used to that, and then you get used to bending, crouching, kicking up like that. Yep. Kick your butt with your heels. Nice, there you go. That's all your practice, that's your handstand practice for day one. That's it, all right? There you go, and it's done. You did it, okay? So when